When the night winds whistle through the trees and blow the crisp brown leaves a crackling down. When the autumn moon is big and yellow orange and round. When old Jack Frost is sparkling on the ground. It's Thanksgiving time. Hello, Lions. That poem is entitled Thanksgiving Time by Langston Hughes. Today is Friday, November 20th, the last day of school before the Thanksgiving break. Can you believe it? It's also just past the halfway point of quarter number two. If you've seen your progress reports, and I'm guessing most of you have, then thankfully you have a week away from school to focus on finishing those assignments that are still outstanding. But you better do it quickly. The end of the quarter is coming faster than we think. Let's look at the calendar for the rest of the year. After a week off, we're back at school on Monday, November 30th. Monday, December 7th is Pearl Harbor Remembrance Day. On December 8th, representatives of Fullerton College will have a Zoom presentation for seniors on financial aid for college. Make sure your academy or fifth period teacher logs in. Then Friday the 11th, Hanukkah begins. The following week, starting Monday the 14th, is final exam week. And this year, all exams are virtual. Monday and the rest of the week, there will be no students on campus. We will be online the entire week. Monday is regular schedule. We change to our final exam schedules Tuesday through Thursday. Again, all online. We'll have more on your final exam schedule next week. Good afternoon, Lions. This is Mrs. Leana. Welcome to the Principal's Perspective. Well, today is Friday, November 20th, and that's a really great day because we are about to have a whole week off for the Thanksgiving break. And as great as that is, it's also true that holidays are a time of heightened stress and anxiety and depression for many people. And that's probably more so true now with the global COVID-19 pandemic. So what I wanna do is draw your attention to a resource that is available to all of us on our district website. So I'm gonna pull up my Chromebook here and show you the district website. And the way that I get to this district website is I type in the initials of our district, which is the Fullerton Joint Union High School District, fjuhsd.org. And once you get to that, you'll see the district website and a list of um, resources across the banner there. And I wanna draw your attention to mental health. Click on that and three things pop down in the drop down. And the one that I wanna look at right now is the virtual calming room. And when you click on that, a whole bunch of things come up and on the sidebar here, you can see all the different resources. There are some guided meditations that you can do. There um, is a journaling section. And in fact, I'm gonna click on that right now. There was something on that that I, I thought was really cool. And that's this one that says cared for. They're all really good, but I like this one. It opens up and it's a series of prompts that ask you um, different, kind of help you remember different ways that you're cared for. So like the first one says, um, one thing that makes you feel calm. And so then you would fill in that box and I might say um, reading. And then the next box asks you one thing that makes you feel confident, one thing that um, makes you feel energized and so on and so on. And by the time you finish going through this document, um, your anxiety it is is way down and you're feeling more cared for which is I thought really cool um, another thing that you can see in the sidebar is they have a whole bunch of um, apps for coloring they also have a bunch of um, apps for um, word games and and what are those called jigsaw puzzles virtual word games and jigsaw puzzles um, the next thing that they have are different sounds and musics that, that you can just play to help you feel um, more centered and more calm. Like if you like the sound of a campfire, you just put that on and you can see the campfire and you can hear that kind of crackling sound. They also have um, some visual relaxation things like this one here is the ocean. You click on that and it's just a bunch of underwater scenes of the ocean which are very um, soothing. And then they have live webcams. And the one that I really like on this one is puppies. And you, um, shoot, where did it go? 
Oh, that's the tigers, which I'm sure is also really cool. But I, lo I love puppies. Um, and so you click on that and these are actual puppies. And you can sit, just sit there and watch puppies. And of course, if you're anything like me, that just makes you happy just seeing that. Um, and then they also have yoga exercises here. And it's like YouTube yoga um, sessions that you can do, um, exercises. And then the last drop down for the whole for the whole website is additional links to resources and of course that's really important because they have things like um, suicide prevention lines and um, a, a, a text that you can get for any kind of support that you might need so check out the district website it's a really good place to um, do all kinds of activities to help you feel calm and centered and to maybe enjoy your holiday a little bit more I hope you all have an amazing Thanksgiving and when we get back in December. Um, I look forward to seeing you all again. In the meantime, stay safe, keep calm and wash your hands. And as always, keep um, making good choices, focusing on your goals and earning all your credit. What am I thankful for? I'm thankful for life. I'm thankful for having this job where I get to be with students every day. Just thankful for life. There's a lot of things to be thankful for, you know, family, friends, being alive, right? You can be thankful every day. Right? I am thankful for my family, definitely. Okay. I'm thankful for my my health that I have. I'm thankful for my family and their health. And I'm thankful that um, I haven't had anybody um, get seriously sick with COVID. I've had a daughter get it and she's fine. So I'm thankful for that. I'm thankful for my family, for my health. Uh, my friends, my pets, and overall, like, having a good life. You know, you hear it all the time from your parents when they get older, so, you know, live a long, good, healthy life. But when you get older, when you get older then you understand why they say that. Um, so I'm just thankful that we're here for right now. For my family, for my health, for good students. I'm thankful for my grandparents. That's it. I am thankful for the health and happiness of my family, my friends, and my co-workers and students here at La Vista La Sierra. Thank you. Finally, Lions, we're going to leave you with the words of poet Joanna Fuchs from her poem, Best Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is here, so our minds have turned to what time has taught us, to what we've learned. We often focused all of our thought on shiny things we've shopped and bought. We take our pleasure in material things, forgetting the pleasure that friendship brings. If a lot of our stuff just vanished today, we'd see the foundation of each happy day. It's special relationships, constant and true, and that's when our thoughts go directly to you. We wish you a Thanksgiving you'll never forget, full of love and joy, your best one yet. Happy Thanksgiving, Lions. For all the good people here at Lions Roar, roar on. We are the lions, oh, oh, oh. we like to move like